Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Emerald, episode 5, I think. Yes, episode 5. In the last episode, we destroyed the opposing gym leader, Roxanne, the Rock Rusboro Rock type gym leader. Anyways, we're just gonna skip Brendan since my Pokemon are now too good for him. So let's just go there. Mm, crap, I have to fight him anyways. Well, I guess you I guess you have a choice of fighting him or not. But let's just fight him. Let's just go ahead. Yes, just go ahead and smite me while you can, bitch. I'm not gonna speed this one up, though. I'll speed up every other one except the gym battle. That's coming up. I- it really- I really wa I'm actually really tempted to speed this up. But I don't want to, because that would piss you off, since I promise not to... speed up any of the other ones. Yes! He's confused! It's about time! Come on, hurt yourself! Hurt yourself in confusion! Yes! That sometimes works. Sometimes I say, hurt yourself in confusion, even though there's nothing in the programming that involves that. Destroy him, Charmander! Show him what you can do! Trico is a freaking pushover. Some Pokemon in this game can actually be pretty threatening. But, they go overboard. They look, they look extremely, they look threatening. However, until you realize they're not that threatening at all. It's really weird. So yeah, blah blah blah, he was a great sailor, I know. Oh, register this guy, because he can give you lots of money later. I don't care about the Orenberry plant, it'll grow on its own, even without the water that I feed it. No, I don't want to get a freaking Poochyana. At least not now. Yes, I want to go to do Ford. Now! And get a call from Dad. Um, I want to skip this guy. Oh. Uh, he saw me coming up, didn't he? No! Shit. Douchebag. You die because you killed my Ralts. And my Ralts was super special to me. Jerk. Not gonna worry about anything that's up there now, at the moment, because I really want to get all this finished. How long have I been recording, anyways? I have a Windows 8, and it totally sucks. I hate it, because anytime you go to the corner, a stupid menu pops up, interrupting everything. Remember how I said I hated it when... Uh... Remember how I said I hated it when the programs stopped working? Oh crap, that was a Pokemon I wanted. But I really, really hate it. Maybe I can get a mud, mud slap on him. Maybe I'll get a Charmander on him too? Dang it, really. I should have known that. Hmm, just run. No, not now. I won't wait until I deliver the letter. Unless there's an exception. But, uh, anyways, like I was saying, I get sidetracked a whole bunch. Uh, like I was saying, I really hate it when the programs just stop responding as if you're not working with it. I just hate it. It annoys me a lot. But anyway, since we're done here, we have the escape rope, so let's use it and get the heck out of there. And check time. Holy hell, I have a lot of spare time. Oh god, what to do in that amount of time? Uh, train routes, maybe? Use him for the gym? Or Taylo? Halo is better for training. But I really like... 
Pointless battle. Just die, please. There. Laura died, and or Laura lost, and she's really sad, and she's crying like a baby. No, I don't have any potions. Gotta go back to the Pokemon Mart. I almost said Pokemon Center. No, I just said I don't want to go to the Pokemon Center. Are you kidding me? We have to go back to Petalburg? Oh yeah, by the way, there is a way to skip the Duper Gym entirely. It doesn't, Flash doesn't really matter in my opinion. You can get through, you can get, you can get the letter, get the letter to Steven, no problem. And the victory road requires Flash, no surprise there, since it, you need all of your skills as a trainer to do that. And you can also skip Winona's gym entirely. But that is going to be a huge problem, because without beating Winona, you can't use Fly. You have to. It would be a great idea if you beat Winona first. So I would much rather, if you're going to skip a gym leader, skip Brawly. But you have to beat Brawly in order to beat the Pokemon League. So, yeah, that's just another cool thing to show. Oh, yeah, by the way, there is a double battle here. Okay, Ralts is in the party, ready to go. Machop and a Metatite. Kill, kill. One hit KO? Ah, oh, forget it. Just use Quick Attack, it's not gonna do anything. Bye, it's just a free turn. Pokemon high level and flash basically lit up everything. Alright, in that spare time, it took me three minutes. Sorry, my mouse is going all over the screen. I'll just leave it in the open there from now on. It doesn't really mess up the video that much. Oh, forgot he's got good Pokemon with him. But that don't matter. Don't matter for sheep. Don't matter for sheep. Don't matter for shit. I just don't like saying shit. I'd rather say damn or whatever. Destroy it with wing attack. And kill it with... Ah, citrus berry! No! Don't use another freaking super potion. Alright, Charmander, you all I got left. And Charmander gets all the experience for himself. After everyone else did I don't want him to evolve yet. Not now, at least. However, he learns Metal Claw when he turns to a Charmeleon, too. I don't know when he learned Metal Claw. Alright. I have about five minutes left in recording, so in that time, let's go to Slateport City. Oops. Or, actually, let's go back to Petalburg and get that sp special item from Mr. Stone first. Because that seems like a little bit of more importance than going ahead right at the moment. Slack off! I could probably use one. Not now. My teacher loves Sloth, so if she were to play Pokemon, she would fall in love with that Pokemon. But... I don't know. Alright, let's go inform that person that we gave him his letter. Gave Steven his letter. Aha! Alright. You delivered the letter? Thank you kindly. This is the way of thanking you. EXP share! You can get it that early in the game. You can get it after getting a single gym badge, or after getting one, or after getting two gym badges. I always go through the tunnel first. And I have more time than I thought. I have, I actually have five minutes right now. As of, n as of now, I have five minutes. So, I'm gonna go catch a Pokemon that I really like in Rock Tunnel. 
and unfortunately, I'm sorry guys, I have no idea how to edit out stuff with proper technique, so my apologies, but I'll try to make it really quick, I'll just speed through all the battles, that is not that Pokemon, which appears to be a lot of them, maybe he's fine on the next floor, apparently so. Okay, I want to find one in, that's in the tens or something. Ugh. Maybe twelve? Not you. Not you. Definitely not Zubats. No! I tell you, Zubats are annoying as hell. I, I know Sableye is cool, but... Come on, Aaron! Aaron? Oh my god, please be level, at least level 11. No, not you, Makuita. Even though you're the only one who actually heeds my words. Ooh, Abra. I've never seen an Abra in this tunnel before. Okay, fine. A level 10 will have to settle with that. What the oh my god, and I had to kill it! Okay, another one showed up. That's nice. Great. Ember doesn't kill it! Great. Let's try catching it. If not, we'll have to give it a piece of stun spore. Okay, time for a piece of stun spore. Go shroomy! me! There. Caught it. Iron armor. Apparently, in Aaron's Pokedex entry, it says that it sheds its iron skin or iron, like, armor and grows new ones. And those iron scraps that he drops are used for metalwork. Alright, so I have three or so minutes left, so let's go to Slateport. Speeding up the boating, take this double battle, and win it like beasts. Because we're totally awesome. Okay, there we go. And we'll get to Slateport here. And stop the video here. Uh, wait, no, I don't want to stop the video here, because I want to show you this first. No, I want to leave it for next episode. I can't decide. And I'll also name my Pokemon in the next episode. Lots of things to do, so little time, because the time limit is 15 minutes. Thank you guys for watching Let's Play Pokemon Emerald Episode 5. This is Charmander465, signing out.